underway in this match of the week in the second leg of the quarterfinals in the HF Champions League women. Chris O'Reilly with you on the mic in the Audi Arena. So no surprises about the starting lineup. Chap Chet was their top scorer on the line last week at, in a battle there early doors. Roberts breaking down the right-hand side, and that is a perfect start from a Viper's perspective. They're pretty slow off the mark to turn this around. Uh, seven goal deficit away from home is a big, big ask as we see here, but cut out by Stina Oftedal. Great. Dancing out to her left. In. Two or three goals, maybe four goals in the last 10 minutes. They will have some kind of chance. Uh, and saves like that from Christina Lunda. Katrina Lunda, rather not her sister. Katrina Lunda, rather not her sister. Christina, Katrina Lunda will always give them an opportunity. A legend of the sport in goal, still going strong as a good start for Lunda. And as soon as I say that, another save for a ball over the top. And this time connects with Kennelly Cobra from a long way out. We're seeing all of a sudden, perhaps for the first time this season, why Vipers Christian Sand are the three times within two and a half minutes. And uh, Perry Hansen watching on there. It could be another turnover and a Vipers ball here. Ball through the middle. Uh, connects with Yamina Roberts, 4-0. Will there be a super early timeout here from Perry Hansen? And Jörn. Yeah, Thomas Flatty, they do have that uh, winning DNA captain delivering her sides first, and that'll give them a momentary bit of respite. But for how long? Nice ball into the line, and son of an S. Anderson who snuck in from the left wing, popping in that goal. 5 1 lead for Jared in Christian Sand. Ball out to cross, finds her wing, and shoots it straight at Katrina Lunda. That's not what you want to be doing at this point in the contest. Building up momentarily, shocked into silence, but finding their voice. Uh, uh, shot past the keeper. Counter. Hogstep uh, to Christiansen. Finds a little space between one and two down the left hand side. That's a good finish. Exactly what Jura needed. Veronica Chris Christiansen. Keep it going to keep the scoreboard ticking over. Make sure they stay in contention here. Nice pass, the timing on the run as well. Absolutely beautiful from Yamina Roberts. Great combination between her and Viacareva. Three goals already for Roberts. And the response is cut out. The save by Lunda on Offi. Burjesson will face Anna Gross. He sent there the wrong way. First of the day for Gross. Ball out to the wing. Off the crossbar. There's Anna Gross on the counter attack. Lays it off to Hogstad and save. Rebound. And this is what Vipers want as long as they hold on to the ball. Far side. Nice breakthrough. And the sit off with a confidence boot boosting save of her own. Nothing she can do about that. Nice shot down low for her opening goal of the contest. Tight angle for the shot here from off the roll. Gross. Going to find the line, but spilled. Goes one more ball back into the line with her, and an attacker foul. Jared and in recent seasons at Vipers, so knows both clubs very well. Nice save, rebound picked up down the left wing as Vipers are already on the counter attack, but it doesn't matter. Double save for Katrina Lunda, much to the dismay of the home fans. Three minutes, there'll be trouble here for the home side. Ball slipping out of the hands of Roberts, and a chance now for Jared to break. Ball down the right-hand side. Jared Lukacs this time finds a way past the keeper. She wanted to really make sure this time around. That kid's Abing trying to create some space down the centre, but it's in this game, and uh, four up on aggregate, mind you. Uh, the steal, great steal by Roberts. Ball across the net, Anderson. On point so far for Vipers. Ball into the line. Bratzadala shooting straight at the keeper, and referees say play on. Vekareva as a left hander on the left hand side can be a little bit awkward. She does seem to like it, though that pass not a great one. A counter attack opportunity for Hovden. Oh, to save that is. Katrina Lunda coming up big again. A penalty given for the challenge on Emilia Hovden. Back in to face Gross once more in the penalty. Uh, once again, can do nothing to Roberts. See, no real attempt here. Ball back into the line. That's a nice idea. A little bit slow, but inside defending by Lena Hogstead. And you mean Roberts, you know, the will take the penalty. He fakes it once. Um, 
bounces it across the keeper's face and into the near post. Gross this time takes it upon herself to take the shot. A well saved for Hosta. Gross. Oh, what a pass out to the wing. Hovden has to put it away and just sneaks it in between the arms of the keeper. A rare goal from the right wing in this match. And back into the middle of the attack. Cersei Anugalan off the crossbar. And the re. Cersei Anugalan to Roberts. Ball out to the wing. Son of an S. Anderson off the crossbar for a second time. I think that's four times already that Vipers have hit the crossbar. And Zeminko uh, setting up Gross. A uh, little block there before a save by Lunda. Counter attacking stolen for the Citadel. Her transition defense has really been on point so far. Uh, from the steal to the goal down the other end. And Roberts trying to counter. She does. Ball across then to Minko. Nice ball into the line, but shot wide to the right. A late call for a penalty. Harry Bratzadala. And for the third time in a row, Anna Gross puts away the penalty. It's one between the sides. To Roberts in the center, and the ball stolen by Antoninko. Counter attack opportunity here. Veronica Christiansen away like a flash. And they're level. Jern uh, bounce back from 4 0 down on the night to go 9 9. And it mark. All out to the wing. Then Lakova. Oh, and the keeper got a touch on that top. Having a stormer so far tonight. Four from four for her. Ryu Yunhi in a right back and uh, skips right through the center of the defense. Cersei Anugalan has a little bit of space and off the post again. That's the off to Berkreva taking over in the center. Abing, good range for her, but a good block. That's it. Down the right hand side, back into Lena Hawks at Enzaminko to the wing. Not much space on the wing either, but the shot right through the keeper. And it's the first of the day for Nadine Shaleshi Safchatzel. Berkreva not going to break through. She lays off that pass, but maybe a little bit early. They make up. In the lead. Oh, great pass. Has to be put away. It is put away by Luisa Schultze. That draws Vipers level on the night. Seven down on aggregate. Goal. Off the doll. Right at the keeper. Second wave counter attack goal. And no attacker foul call there. Or was it? It was indeed. No, it was a goal. <laughs> a little confusion. Again, six down on aggregate. Ryu, nice pass into the line and put away. Back to all four players across the Jura defense in the center. Very, very strong and forcing a basically 0% chance there for Vekreva. Try to sneak it between the legs. On for Ryu. Gets it back. This time we'll have to take a long range shot. Focusing more on the next move than ball just simply going into their hands that's a good breakthrough and the touch on the keeper Vipers the lead once more two in a row for her three on the night ah what a response Estelle and Tominko oh, that classic little Abing and almost stolen again in fact it is stolen Hofton ball back out to Oftedal who finds the line could save the near post first shot of the day for Lynn Blum lays it off to Vekareva again going sideways here oh and a bit of fortune and we'll see how it all develops it's Chris O'Reilly live with you from the Audi Arena and it's quite enough start from the crowd uh, getting their rhythm now and a goal here early doors will help but Ryu denied and the rebound kept in well by Vekareva great hustle and uh, on goal Shot off, oh, tipped onto the crossbar. Good goalkeeping by Sandra Toft. Off the doll. Ball into the line. Ryu to the wing. Not much of a run up here and saved at the near post. This backcourt trio together with Roberts. Avea Kareva and Roberts can't find their players. Breaking over the halfway line. Ryu out to the wing. Hofton again. And enough space there for Hofton. Has to keep the ball moving and a turnover call by the referee. Roberts. 
the space on the right hand side but clipped off the outside of the post into the heart of the big pink wall and defense another turnover the passive play turnovers in a row ball out to the right wing and still no goal Sandra Toft with the save closes the legs right at the perfect time Passing time Chris Janssen to the wing and saved again Roberts the bear Kareva Roberts, she's got a bit of space, and another touch from the keeper, but this time it does find the back of the net. Almost five minutes of play before we get our first go. Kuypers. Gross. Nice ball out to the wing, and saved at the near post again. Oh, the door has been slammed shut by Katrina Lunda. There must be six cat amongst the pigeons. Bekareva, Roberts, good timing again, and earns the penalty. That combination working a treat between Anna Vekareva and you mean going down almost all the way back in her line. Feels she can react to it and she can. Backed herself, Rinka Doin Dam, and rightly so. The second half so far. Bruno Giapaola in for the first time today. And a little pass, Thunder. And a turnover called traveling against Vipers and it could be two in a row oh it's not Katrina Lunda uh, beaten there in the previous shot by Bruno Japan Had a relatively quiet game so far can she find something tipped off the crossbar and the rebound up for grabs and it's taken by Roberts oh but it's time in the center with Vorda gross and uh, tipped away tipped over the crossbar by the keeper don't know what he's looking so dismayed at it's uh, the situation or his teammates shooting. That's a brilliant finish on the left hand side by Yamina Roberts. Jurlik to Japaula. Wide to the left wing. And it doesn't find the intended beat. Abing. There, Kareva. Roberts, she's in form right now. And you can see it the confidence in her body language floating through the defense there. Nobody going out to her. Gross. Moves it off to Japaula. Enzaminko to the wing. Schatzel shoots wide to the right. Out. Roberts, Abing, nice ball, out to the wing, has to be put away and is. It's excellent work, a patient work in the attack. And they continue looking for that speed, but they're all hesitant, it feels. And to make a break through and a save again by Lunda. Ball out to the right-hand side, and the spin is given as an attacker foul by there. Japola. Oh. Vekareva. <laughs> and, uh, well, Zeminko. Japola to the wing. And another. So will come in. Abing. Uh, stolen by Ryu and takes a tumble. The referee say play on. Ryu and he. Or coming up here against the three time reigning champions. And Ryu and he finally delivers a goal for Jekyll and said, hand up for passive play. Ah, uh, that's a high challenge. Vekareva takes the hit, and uh, I think the Jura fans reckon she was flopping there a little bit. Second line player, there, a woman up, remember, with that two minute suspension. Oh, and a traveling violation call. Keepers want the ball back quickly. They can't concede. Chris Janssen looks to go alone, and she puts it away. Veronica Chris Janssen with Jura's third goal. They need a goal now, Vipers. Ball across to Roberts. She breaks through and saved onto the post, but a penalty given. Late call there. Celia Solberg. The uh, fine. Greva steps back in her line again. Greva has more power and sends her the wrong way. And extends the lead on the night to Chris Johnson. Off the doll. And to Ryu, good timing there. And uh, Ryu earns a penalty. And a two-minute suspension. Back. Anna Gross will take it. Been perfect from the penalty line so far today, and that doesn't change. Pins it into the top left-hand corner. And Lil comes into the backcourt in the absence of Roberts. Abing still yet to come up with much here, and uh, that a uh, bit of a fortunate goal from a Viper's perspective. Oh, nice move, and saves onto the crossbar, and onto the crossbar a second time. 
Katrina Londa having the game of her life. Oh, no. good save. Equal to it. Chris Janssen looking to inject some pace. She's found a way through. And she finds a way past the keeper. Roberts back in after serving her two-minute suspension. With gold in the pursuit of gold. Ryu almost took steps there, but laid it off. Gets it back from Roberts. Ball into the line, tipped away. Chris Johnson on the break and a stolen back by... With a rare mistake in the second half. Roberts with an attacker foul. Ryu through. And that should... Four and a half minutes away from a ticket to Budapest. Breakthrough. And a save. Penalty given. This penalty. Maybe a much needed confidence booster. She gets the goal. Take on Vorda. She loves this kind of space. Almost stolen. But Ryu clean through this time. Save one so far. She faced her three times. It saves it fourth time. Very strong in defense now. Arcos with the shot across the face of goal and the save by Solberg. And you feel like that's got to do it. Managed to find the extra gear. Ball out to the wing. And it's off the post, the penalty given. Once again, a fake from Gross. Uh, this time makes no mistake. Back at the scoreboard, it's been all penalties for Anna Gross, but how important are those here, just like the players are. Bekareva looking for the line, it does well at this level. So we have seen it today, a steed off the all. Iwan is going to do anything here, just like the players are. Bekareva looking for the line, it does well to find Schultz at this level. So we have seen it today, a steed home for another crack at the title. It's been five years since they last won it. Roberts continues to put to the test big time. They were pushed all the way by Vipers, but Jody out in the end. There's your score 26.